Hey, yo, what's good, niggas? It's your boy, Mr. Wolf. Yeah, so I'm on the train right now. I'm on Amtrak. I know you, could, you probably can't even hear me, but, but like, barely. But I'm on the train right now. I'm chilling. You feel me? I am actually on my way back to Virginia. Well, not on my way back, but I'm heading to Virginia. Yes, today's the day. It is Wednesday, I think the 18th of August as I'm recording this. It's about, like, 1 o'clock. My train got freaking delayed. Like, there's no surprise there. I leave it to Amtrak to just delay my my rides all the time probably gonna be making videos little sporadic videos throughout just kind of showing you around campus showing you my room showing you stuff that's around also look at the view beautiful as shit ain't it i know just like me <laughs> but um yeah man this is just the start of the beginning or the beginning of something amazing um this is my senior year, and I just plan to have fun, just record my experiences, just be in the moment of shit, and you know, just kind of see where it goes. So, yeah, man, you see it, we back, the land of Troy. You feel me? Sorry, COVID. You got to try a little bit harder to kill me, nigga. We back at it, man. It's been a year and a half since I've seen this place. Still looks the same, but you know what? Don't fix what's not broken, right? Right. So. About to head to my new fucking dorm, start a brand new semester. Haven't seen a lot of you niggas in a while. Probably y'all look a little fat. Not gonna lie. I need to get back into the gym so I can lose some weight. But you know what? The skin is glowing and I love to see it. I really do love to see it. All right, what's going on, everybody? Um, so as you can see, I am in my dorm. Ch I'm chilling, you feel me? Um, there was some shit that actually happened that I actually have to tell you guys about. So after I left the train, I couldn't enter my original dorm because I had came in late. There is a certain time period that you need to be coming into your dormitory. And mine was like around 12 so or 11, I, I believe. So I couldn't go in at all. Um, and even though like I showed my vaccination card, they didn't know if I was like positive or negative or whatever. Cause you know, even when you're vaccinated, um, you can still get the virus, so I had, to, I had to live in a whole other dormitory, which was a whole other walk you know, from campus. Because my campus is very big, y'all. And mind you, you know, it's summertime, it's Virginia, and it is hot. Like, it's very humid. Like, the, the, the air here is very dense. It's just not good at all. Spend the night there. It was a little lonely, I'm not even gonna lie, because, like, there was nobody, like, around the rooms. I mean, then again, it's a a dorm where like they throw people there uh what's it called if you're not that like you know if you're not um if you're positive it's basically like a, a quarantine room an isolation room but you know morning time came got my shit done got my covid test i'm all good to go i'm negative and i moved in you know this is not everything uh, eventually i do want to like get other stuff like fixed in or whatever I think I probably might show footage of that on Saturday, I believe. But yeah, um, just had to like catch you guys up on what was going on because I didn't uh, explain any of that. But yeah, you know, I'm just chilling. You know, this is what we're eating right now. It's completely just junk food. Um, you know, just got chips, tackies, just a whole bunch of stuff all over the place. Hi, I'm back again. And it's been about a week since I've been back at school and shit. And uh, yeah, I'm here. We're gonna show you the room tour, which it'll be now my third room that I've moved into. So let's fucking get started. So first we got the freaking closet. Yes, family, we got the trash bag. Shout out to the trash bag. But you know, we got the motherfucking closet, nigga. You see the fucking drip, nigga? I wish I had like a oh, flashlight so you can see that shit. But you know, fuck. Um, you can see like, you know, my, my sweater is here. You got the full area right here. You know, I got my cakes right here, nigga, if I'm ready to go out and just do shit. You know the fucking vibe, man. So that's like my wardrobe, my little shit right there. This is my work area. I got my computer. I got my sketchbook. I got my headphones, switch, lotion, TV, lamp, all that stuff. This is my bed, my jail bed with some nice ass uh, sheet covers. I freaking love these covers so much with, you know, really thick, really soft ass pillow. You feel me? I need to get a foam mattress because this freaking mattress is hard as nails. So I don't like that at all. So yeah, this is like my side of the room. Pretty freaking cool, pretty eye. Then we got 
the refrigerator, the top of the refrigerator. You know, we had the you know, the wipes, we got all the refreshments, the Gatorade, uh, I got the bowls in case I want to get some ramen. Uh, motherfucking wipes again. And in my fridge, we just got water because we got to stay hydrated during the quarantine and in Virginia because it's fucking hot. Uh, we also got laundry bag, dirty laundry and shit. We got a new addition of the family. We got my skateboard, nigga. Yes, this is the first time uh, I've ever brought my skateboard at school because I am not walking to classes, nigga. Fuck is you talking about? Even though my... um. My uh, goddamn classes are close. Like my uh, dorm is closest to my uh, my classes, but no, no, in this hottest weather, no. And then you got me, nigga. I'm recording myself. It's a me section. Do you see that shit? Oh, oh, oh we started it, nigga. But anyway, this is my mirror. You feel me? This is um, where I wipe my hands. You know, all the hygiene shit, Brett toothbrush, toothpaste, Listerine, freaking black African soap, stuff for my hair. Mirror again, think, which sucks because it's just literally like, what the fuck is this right now? Like, come on now. And it only puts in hot water, but whatever. Um, So we got the bathroom. Bathroom was I, we, I need a freaking holder for my freaking whatever. You know, you got the, you know, nothing too crazy. And uh, yeah, that's my fucking room. This is like, this is the room. This is right here. We we out here. Uh, Looks pretty, you know what I'm saying? I like it. I like it more than more, honestly, because for more is a fucking atrocious ass <laughs> dorm. <laughs> but I like Gateway, Gateway's cool. I had to show you guys a room tour real quick. <laughs> you know, while I took this time, out to get out of my room. I actually listened to the new Cleo Soul album. Uh, it's called Mother, I believe. Uh, she just dropped it today, literally the day I'm recording, which is the 20th of August. So I was listening to that and it was actually pretty good. Um, I don't know if I enjoy it much as Rose in the Dark, but it's still an enjoyable project from start to finish. I think she makes and paints a beautiful picture of her life and you know, it's a lot of great central themes that I think this generation definitely does need to hear about self-importance, about self-love and self-care. Just kind of like going back and piggybacking off of the things that she said on her last project. I think her voice has improved. I think the instrumentals has definitely took like a great like uh, pool of, Im of improvement. And just the presentation overall, the sound of this is fantastic. It's definitely a lot better than her last, well, just, you know, as far as comparison is concerned. Um, I do say that some of the songs were a little too long. They kind of ran a little too long for me. Like, there's some songs off this project that are, like, eight minutes long, seven minutes long, six minutes long. And it's like, you really need to make those long songs. Like, I think you can get your point across without really, like, overextending the, you know, the song, you know what I'm saying? But I don't know. I mean, the, song is al the songs are already great that it's like, you know what? It, they could justify their, their length, but I don't know. I just feel like it just kind of overall, um, I don't know, dampered the experience a little bit, but that's just my opinion personally. I got to give it another listen. It's literally my first time listening. First spin, no skips, no nothing, no distractions. And yeah, I'm really enjoying it, man. So if you haven't heard of Cleo Soul, uh, if you heard of Little Sims, she's definitely uh, featured on a, front, a few of uh, Little Sims songs. So if you haven't got a chance already, listen to uh, Cleo Soul. The album is called Mother, and if you love it, go support her on Bandcamp. Uh, I think she's doing merch pretty soon, but uh, everything's gonna be pretty much shipped out like later this year. So I don't know why the hell my mask keeps on doing this. Also, <laughs> I'm gonna see my fucking bestie today, and I'm so freaking excited, bro. Like I literally manifested this shit. Like I was like, man, I want to see my best friend so bad. I want to see my best friend so bad. Freaking texting, yo, I'm gonna be coming to VSC. I'm like, bitch. What the fuck? Oh my god, bro. Mmm. Ooh. So one thing I know that I should know about this girl, like she makes me happy, bro. Like that's all you just need to know. Like she makes me happy. She makes me smiling. Nigga, I'm cheating through the, the freaking mask right now. Nigga, that's how you know what I'm saying she making me feel. So yeah, I'm just excited to see her. We're gonna see how that goes. Alright, I'm done talking. This is about five minutes long, so. Nigga, I was so excited in that fucking preview video. The level of disappointment that I would have that day too was fucking excruciating. 
Anyway, guys, that's the end of the video. As you can see, it was just a random ass collection of videos, man. It's only been a week since I've really been back. So, you know, hasn't been a lot of shit that I can really show off. But anyways, guys, if you guys like these type of videos, let me guys know. I promise to make a video that's a little bit much more concise and a little bit more organized than this one. Because this was just all over the place as far as this video timelines are concerned. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. I really do appreciate it. I'm happy to be back in school. Hopefully that, um, you know, I don't know, uploads might uh, slow down because I'm in school and, you know, I got to do a lot of projects and a lot of stuff just has to be done. So if you don't really see me like that, sorry, life happens. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you laughed and I'll see you guys whenever I see you. Peace.